Hello, everybody, and welcome to a crate opening. These crates have been extinct in Rocket League now since the loss of player to player trading. But thankfully, I did build up and I did stock up on over 4,000 of these golden crates before trading ended. So today, we are going to be opening over 100 of these for you guys. Let's go ahead, get started, and wish me some luck. I'm definitely going to need it. All right, we're going to start off with the rare at the bottom, but hey, we're starting off with the painted right off the bat. That's not too bad. That's okay. As you can see, I do have 900 of these crates. These are real. They're not spawned in with Bacchus Mod or anything like that. Nice. First pair of painted wheels. Not bad. Saffron. Okay. Not the best wheels in the world, but we'll definitely take them. As I said before, I built up so many of these crates. We're going to be opening over 100 of these today, and hopefully we can end up walking away with at least one or two black markets. Maybe some wheels that I was looking forward to ho holding on to. Nice. Okay. Another very rare. Awesome. At least it was an octane decal this time. I'm kind of surprised that that wasn't painted. It looked really strong with like the orange or saffron maybe, but... Guess not, but that's okay. There are only four crates in, but only one rare so far. Nice, another very rare. Okay. Ah, oh, picket wheels. Honestly, I don't mind these at all. You guys are going to have to let me know at the end of this video what your favorite item is that we end up getting. There we go, and we're going right into the first import, the apparatus wheels. I do, I believe, have one or two of these painted. I would love to get some more of these painted. However, these were not, but you know, that's okay. It was a special edition though. I do forget that sometimes a couple of these wheels, including I believe the picket wheels in here can come special edition. All right. I do believe in luck. I do. Ooh, nice. Okay. Second import of the opening striker certified. That is the best and highest certification in the game. Four screen is kind of more of a mid tier color, but I will definitely take it. I definitely don't have this one already. So that is not a bad pull. Okay, another rare. I am liking that we're getting a couple imports sprinkled in here and there now. I would love to see some exotics though. I feel like sometimes I get more black markets than I get exotics. Ooh, okay, we're just going strong with the car bodies. Another import. This one isn't painted, but that's perfect trade-up material later on. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, another rare. Okay. It's always teasing me when it puts out the yellow light. I always think I'm going to maybe get an exotic, but you never know. Another rare. Back-to-back -back rares. That's not what we're hoping for. Oh, no. Ooh, I... Did I hear a boost? Yeah, I think I heard a boost. Let's go. Okay, Fractal Fire. This boost always confuses me. I definitely think it's always Cobalt anytime I get it because that's just the base color, but it's such a rich dark color with that. It works. It looks not too bad. And it's, again, another import. We still have 77 crates to go. Plenty of chances. Nice. Ooh, let's go. That is actually an item I don't think I have. Purple on the zigzag trail. It's definitely not one of the worst trails in this game definitely not one of the worst i think possible even in this crate and purple is quite a nice color i actually quite like that come on nice another import come on <gasps> hero wheels and yo those are actually painted i sincerely thought those were going to be unpainted i think the default might actually be a little bit more yellow compared to the orange possibly but i actually don't have these in this color so that's fantastic probably one of my favorite pulls so far Oh, I heard another boost. Please be another import. Awesome. Let's go. Oh, ew. Oh, oh no. My ears. My poor ears. We still have 64 more crates, guys. And nice. We got another import. <gasps> Yo. Now those are easily the best thing we've pulled so far. Look how dark and look how clean those are. So nice. Definitely worth holding on to if you guys don't have them. I love these wheels. Those are fantastic. Black and white are definitely the top two colors in the game. That is fantastic. Paragon certified as well. Not a terrible cert. Not the best, but not the worst. Only very rarely do you get that beautiful, magical moment where you have a good item, good color, and good certification. <gasps> Yo, speaking of which, there you go. Eh, I'd say pretty moderate, moderate item, but good color and good certification. There you go. But it's definitely better than the last item we got. <gasps> Finally, first exotic. 
<gasps> Let's go. Finally, finally got an exotic pair of wheels and they're painted on top of that. That's awesome. Let's go. I don't love these wheels personally, just as the base design of them. But you know, hey, this could turn into a future painted black market out of the trade ups. Who knows? But I'll definitely take that. That's awesome. I just wanted an exotic. That's all I wanted. And then we get a rare, of course, right afterwards. You know, they always have to like give you something good and then something bad right after just to humble you. That's how that works. Let's see, come on. Okay. I'm still hoping for the very rares. I still get happy even when it's a very rare popping up because I'm definitely trying to build up as many of those painted wheels as I can. Not so much the rares though. Ouch. <laughs> that is definitely not a great pull. Ooh, I heard another boost. Nice. I'm loving the amount of imports we're getting so far. And we got painted on the fractal fire. So that's what painted on the fractal fire looks like, guys. We did get unpainted earlier, which was much more of that really dark navy blue. But now we got lime and juggler certified. Really bad cert, but it's definitely a much nicer boost when painted. All right. And then right back down to a rare, but at least it's an octane rare. I still want at least another one or two exotics, and I still haven't seen a black market, however. Worst case scenario, guys, I guarantee we're probably going to get at least one black market out of the trade ups because of how many crates we're opening. So we're going to walk away with a black market no matter what we do, but it's so much more fun to pull them and we have 32 more chances. Ooh, oh, I thought that was going to be black. That looks really dark. Gray actually isn't too bad with that one. Okay. Like I said, we're still going incredibly strong with the imports. And now we got the Sentinel in titanium white. Nice. I think we just got two out of maybe three or four of the possible car bodies in this crate in titanium white, the top color of most items in this game. Let's go. Back to back imports, even better. And another titanium white and striker. That is the highest certification, highest color on the worst boost ever oh my gosh i won't make you guys listen to that i hate that sound so much we are swimming in the titanium white right now it is going crazy let's go nice and that is on an octane decal as well that's awesome come on no we are not ending with a bunch of rares come on last crate guys and then we're gonna get into the trade-ups here we go i believe okay come on Come on. No. No. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. We ended on one of the worst possible items, but you know what? It's okay. I still hold out as much hope as I can. We're going to be getting into the trade ups. Yet again, if I didn't say it earlier, guys, this is how the trade up system looks. This is how it works. Basically, every five of each type of item turns into the next rarity. So we're going to trade up five of these rare items and turn it into a very rare and so on and so forth so we will be walking away with the black market today but unfortunately not in the way that we hoped mystery sandwich number one now i want to give a little context i don't know a lot about sandwiches my normal order is ham cheese lettuce salt that's it i'm not a sandwich connoisseur i see a little bit of turkey though i do know what turkey looks like so I see tomato. It's good. I don't know what it is. Seven out of 10? This is like a sandwich you want to like bring home to your parents. You know, it's a nice safe one. It's not gonna scare them off. 7.2. Mystery number two. It looks the same. <laughs> I see it's ham. It looks good. It's not a bad thing. Hmm, sweeter. I'd say pretty similar. No, nah, it's not a bad thing, but I feel like I need like a little bit, a little bit of tang, a little bit of, a little bit of zest, a little bit of pop. 7.9 on this one. Doesn't disappoint though. I'm happy so far. Mystery number three. I feel like they have all relatively looked the same. I'm trying to judge a book by its cover, but you know what they say, don't do that. So I think that's what we were missing. Maybe that was the zest, maybe that was the pop. The flavor is, is, is a little more, not in your face, it's just it's a little more there. I think it's uh, 8.75. That's the final answer. Mystery sandwich number three, best one of them, in my opinion. It was the Blimpy Best. Oh, I see why they call it the Blimpy Best now. I like it. Well, there you go. They know what they're doing. They got the secret sauce, so uh, 
I'll listen to them. Next time you go to Blimpy Sandwich, you listen to them too. Ooh, that is a huge upgrade. And we turned it into some Saffron Certified Painted Picket Wheels. There we go. So that is how that works, guys. That is awesome. Definitely getting rid of all of these odd fishes, all of these unpainted decals as well. Definitely have no use in my inventory. Here we go. Zigzag. Oh, no paint on that one. Come on. Getting rid of the clod hoppers. Come on. Here we go. Zigzag. Oh, no color again. Come on. And we got more picket wheels. Let's go. We barely pulled any during the opening itself, but through the trade ups, we've now gotten two of these painted, which is fantastic and both different colors as well. So I'll definitely take it. All right, here we go. Very rare to import. Going to trade up most of these as well, I believe, especially the unpainted. Let's start there. Heroes. Oh, I would have loved to get a third color of those. Oh my goodness. The amount of these Diomede wheels that we got unpainted is crazy. Definitely don't need three of the same paint finish. You can only use it once anyway. Let's hold on to the painted trails, at least one of each. Ooh, okay, there we go, more painted. I think we did get lime of the fractal fire earlier. Maybe it was forest green, I don't remember. It was some sort of green, I think. Got the two dot matrixes. Imperator, okay. I don't think we got too many of those earlier, so that's all right of a pull. That one, here we go. More Sentinel Striker. Again, again, fantastic certifications for a lot of this opening so far. Didn't have the lift off yet. We'll hold on to that one. I did already have white of the Octane Kana, so let's get rid of that. And here we go. This will be the last very rare to import trade up, and then we have a ton of imports to get rid of. Here we go. And it's a snake skin. Okay. <laughs> Definitely not an item I think worthy of the import rarity, in my opinion, but you know, whatever. All right, here we go. First exotic trade up. Three two one <gasps> creeper wheels creeper wheels are actually kind of nice in my opinion if you get them in black the black painted pair of these wheels are actually kind of sick i don't really love the overall look of the most of the other colors but black is actually pretty cool so you know i'm kind of okay with getting that unpainted we're just gonna head that towards the trade-ups anyway and yes i will be trading up the striker white ninja star i will never use it bite me all right here we go second exotic three two one what did i just say what did i just say rocket league i said i didn't want these painted in any other color come on <laughs> well there we go there if you guys wanted to see what they look like now you do there you go there is lime painted creepers all right here we go next one three two one Hikaris, I'm actually okay with that. Surprised we didn't at least get like some certification or something. But again, this is all perfect trade up material for a black market. I will not be feeling guilty or bad about trading up any of these exotics so far, at least. Okay, guys, I think this is going to be the last, yes, the last exotic trade up, okay? All right, last exotic before the black market trade up, guys. Here we go. Three, two, one. We got titanium white. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. That act, the reactor wheels again in black and titanium white look super cool. I really like those. Thankfully though, we will still get still get to do a black bar because I already have one of these. So it's okay. We're all right. But that's still a really cool thing to pull though. Moment of truth. Highest quality item in the entire video. Here it is. I'm hoping for painted for sure. If we don't get painted, I'm gonna tell myself I'm gonna be okay and everything will be all right. But that is definitely the goal here. We are trading up not one, not two, but three painted exotics in this trade up. So we're definitely hoping for painted for the black market. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Sub-Zero? No! <laughs> oh no! That is so sad. I was really hoping for painted. That one could have been painted. That is one of the black markets that is possible to have a paint attached to it. There are a small handful of black markets that can't be painted no matter what, but this was one of them. This could have been painted. That is so sad, but you know what? It's okay. I still had a ton of fun. I hope you guys liked this video. Make sure you drop your favorite item that we pulled in the comments and I'll see you guys next time.